Come, settle your mind and tell me what you have seen. Strange things, Volker. I'm learning much and seeing more than my mind can understand. Go on. In Jotunheim, I sought and found a mead of incredible power. It promised a strange effect. To drink it would deliver me from death, shield me from the destruction of Ragnarok. By this mead, I hope to live beyond my own death, well into the future. Fascinating. Was that your final vision? They have not ended, not yet. Something compels me to return to Asgard. The elixir is ready when you are. Alrighty, guys. So, um, if you didn't understand anything I was talking about just then with, like, Juno and things, um, there's a video, I will probably forget to link it, but just look on my channel, it's called Lore You Need to Know Before Starting Assassin's Creed Valhalla, and that will, uh, that'll help you out there. It is a bit confusing, and, uh, yeah. Alrighty, guys, well, that is, man, these guys are still arguing. It's been, it's been months. Uh, I talk to that lady over there. Alright, guys, well... That's the end of the uh, the Asgard trip for now. We will do that final part in another couple of episodes or so. And uh, yeah, I think we will get back on with the main story over here. And uh, yeah, we'll see what to do. I have 12 skill points. Okay, I better spend those. Very cool. Eivor, out the gate. I want to see the Alliance map. All right. So this is the one we can go do if we want to save Sigurd straight away. I've done Essex. Um, what? 250. 190. Okay, we could do Jorvik. Should we go do Jorvik, guys? This Tell seems interesting. Hytham says there are three more targets there. If that is true, you are in luck. Our old friends Jor and Ljuvina have made their homes in Jorvik. Both had status and influence in Norway, so they may have valuable insights into the city's politics. That will make my work easier. What say you then? Uh, I think we will do that, guys, because there's a bureau there as well. So that tiny little area there, we're going to go and conquer. Okay, very cool. I think we... I'm not sure what level we'll power now. we are, but we're not do 250. You know where I find your and so. When entering a new city, it is best to ask around the ports. The people there know more than the average peasant. Uh, yeah, let's see what actual power level we are. Inventory here. 191. Okay, perfect. So that is good. We can we can go and do that now. Uh, yeah, that other one is 250, so we probably won't be able to do that before saving Sigurd. Uh, we just want as many allies as possible to come with us in the fight. So yeah, there's, there's, uh, that's pretty cool. Right, we need to head all the heckin' way up there, guys. So I guess we're going to fast travel. I'll get this on the way. And probably get this on the way as well. Let's uh, get rid of that. Uh, let's get this uh, this gear and this synchronization point, and then we'll head over here. And one of these will be the uh, Assassin Bureau, so we might want to put... The I'm not going to link that up just yet, because we'll get confused. And uh, yeah, one of those will be the Assassin Bureau, so we'll go and find that straight away. You know what, guys? I'm just getting in here, looting it, and getting out again. Mentor's Mars. Oh, holy heck. Let me out. Let me out. Okay, we're good. We got the mentor's helmet mask thing. They look terrible, but, you know, that's not really what I wanted. Anyways, guys, let's... Oh, no, there's wolves and all sorts of things. We need to get out of here. Come on, horse. Please let me on the horse. Please let me on the horse. Now let's get out of here. No, 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 no. Go, horsey, go. Look at this, guys. Look at this world. It's just amazing. There's some ruins down there. I think that's Doncaster over there. We're just running along the road here. And yeah, it is just... Wow. This game is just... It's just so beautiful. It actually really, really is. Alright, guys. This might be the entrance. You never know. We'll give it a go. 
Oh, it is the entrance. Oh, okay, that is fantastic. We've found it. Okay, very cool. So I'm guessing it was that armor piece, but we just have to go a long way to get it. Cool, cool, cool. Let's swim up. Awesome, we've found the bureau. I love these bureaus so much. Righty, what is going to be the puzzle today, my friends? Okay, this looks like Assassin's Creed. Holy heck. Looks exactly like a... Uh... Oh, there's some stuff right there. Not that I can get in there. Okay, there's a couple of keys. Stuff around. Uh, maybe we need a torch. Can we light this on fire? Can we light you on fire? Why can't I light you on fire, you freaks? All right, uh, so we're gonna we're gonna lose our torch now. Let's try over here. Let's go for a big climb first of all. Uh, we can go this way. Skip across these. I mean, this isn't really helping us because we can sort of go anywhere here. We need to check everything out. There's an assassin's flag. Okay. Okay, anything down here? Uh, some silver. We can swim up under here. Ah, we can get this. Alright, that's how we get this chest. Okay, I think that's all there is for this little area up here. Go up here. I uh, got some some punching bags and whatnot, fighting bags, I suppose they'd be called. And you know what? You guys probably can't see a damn thing because YouTube hates dark things. Um. Okay, well it must be underwater then, because I don't see anything here. Let's try diving under here. So this guy. Nothing over there. Okay, we can go through over here, so let's try this first. Very cool. Whoa, I cannot see a damn thing. How am I supposed to see in here? There we go. Okay, I think that room might have been one big distraction. Okay, maybe not. Okay, yeah. We made it in. Very cool. Lots of stuff to loot. Uh, did we miss anything here? Alright. Very cool. Okay, find the key for the chest, I see. This is just the ex 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 excavation? That's not the word. Evacuation? Thank you. Brain. Useless brain, honestly. Right, so we're in here. We just need a key. Okay, so we can check out there. Alright guys, it's time for reading. Okay, I thought that was going to be much lo longer. A faded note, interloper, seek high if you wish to pass beyond. We have no further use for the tools that have failed us. QDBV. Seek high if you wish to pass beyond. Uh, over here? I thought we might be able to go behind this banner here. So this door's locked, right? Yeah, we need a key to get in there, and we need a key for that over there. Break this off. Open this out here. Where does this go? I presume this is just the way out, but I'm gonna double check before I uh, just say it definitely is. Maybe not. Oh, hello people. Yeah, this is this is just the way out, so let's go back down. And hopefully we can figure out what's going on to get the rest of these keys in there. So there's some there's definitely a key in there. There is a key in that room, I think. So that key will be for this chest. I just need to find one other key. 
out here somewhere. All right, guys, I found a sneaky way into here. Very cool. We get another chest here. There's no key in here, thing is there? Let's check up high because it keeps saying check up high. I see nothing else in this room. All right, well we got the loot at least. Oh my goodness, that's what I meant by look up high. There's a key right on top of the desk. On top of the cabinet, I mean. Unbelievable. I am useless. All right, now we can get our gear. Here we go. Hidden One's robes. Okay, guys, I presume these are going to be green, but, you know, let's have a look anyway. Uh, let's make sure we... Okay, we got the Magister's robes on right now. Hidden One's robes. Very green, my friends. I think we're going to go straight back to the Magister's ones. There we go. I, I think I like the Magister's gear so far. I might collect that. I mean, I don't know where it is, so it's just sort of luck of the draw. And we have the key for that. Anything else in here? Uh, here's the codex page. All right, this is codex page two, so... We're reading these out of order, so it's a little bit confusing, but... Another silence. Magus opened his mouth, inhaled, and shut it without speaking. We give this permission to ourselves, the woman said. We are the source of our own purpose. None said a word in reply as the woman looked over us over. It seemed that she was neither pleased nor dissatisfied with our silence. Then she began pacing the room, slowly turning about and looking around our hidden hall with an ex expression that verged on nostalgia or satisfaction. With this knowledge, she continued, With this understanding comes a great, terrible freedom. The freedom to rise or fall, to live or die, by your own volition. This is why our creed cuts as cleanly as a double-edged sword. You must take this paradox to heart. The success or failure of the Brotherhood depends on your willingness to live in the unfeeling emptiness of this world, as if lost in Tartarus. I don't know what that means. Alone and hoping against hope that the door will one day open and let in the light, and that you shall exit, not alone but with all your brothers and sisters at your side. The woman stopped for a moment to run her hand over the dilapidated stony pillar. She seemed to have... She seemed to be reliving an old or half-forgotten memory. Catching herself, she stepped away and continued. Because they were with you all along, your brothers and sisters, beside you in the shadows, you walked in the darkness in silence, but you were never alone. Okay, there we go. What is this one over here? A contractor? Execution. Okay. Imperator Severus flouts the terms of our treaty with Aurelius. He has arrived in Britannia to oversee the fortification and reoccupation of the Antonine Wall. Swift and bold reprisal is needed. The Imperator must die of poison to avoid suspicion of foul interference. Infiltrate Oboricum Villa with caution. Imperators Praetorians will be on high alert. Make contact with the Centurion Calvinists on the morning of, uh, yep, the 3rd non-feb, whatever that says. Um, the Centurion is one of us, and they will provide you with the necessary cover. Success. Nice. Good job, Chloe. Okay, cool. We can go and get what's over there as well. I already read that. Can't believe I didn't get that key. Tungsten ingot, guys. That is fantastic. So we can update our gear even further. Alrighty guys, let's get out uh, get out of here and uh, head to the main mission. That was that was that was a mission in itself. Alrighty guys, we are going to the docks, which is just over there. So we should be. Uh, oh cool, we've got a new fast travel. I don't need to go do that then, but I will at some stage, but not right now. Let's see here. Sure, and Luvin are settled near this harbor. Someone should know where to find them. Alrighty, we'll go talk to this guy over here. Can you help us out, my young friend? Little one, can you help me? I am looking for some friends. Do the names Hjor and Juvina mean anything to you? Mm. I think I know that name. A woman. She's from Biamiland. Very smart. She sounded funny, so I asked her once. Hope it wasn't rude of me. You want to speak to the dot master, Grigory? I've seen him talking with her before. My thanks. Thank you, friend. A little smart-ass, no. Right, um... Right, 
Are we? Be my eyes. Where's this dock master you speak of, my friend? Okay. Here we go. I am looking for some friends. Been told to ask around this harbor. Juvena and Shore. He looks so uninterested. Sure, I know plenty. Of that, I'm certain. Oh, he's not helpful. What a horrible man! All right. Okay, we found a market and a trade place. Uh, none of these people look helpful. All right, there's someone up here to talk. What about me? Move along now. We were on a clean dock in Jorvik. You must be the dog master. What gave it away? Everyone hates you. As I just explained to your friend there, if your wares have been seized, take it up with the council. These merchants are not my friends, but I'm looking for some. Hjor and Luvina. You know Hjor and Luvina? What business do you have with them? We know each other from Norway. Bid farewell to that land, but not to old friends. You may be glad to hear they fare quite well in Jorvik. It does not surprise me. They're driven, and so am I. Now I would like to see them again. In a manor surrounded by flowers. That's where Hjor and Yufina live. What, why do you gotta tell me in a riddle, mate? Just... How about some coin for my trouble? How about I cut out your tongue? Forget I said anything. Whoa, whoa, whoa. A manor, Hjor and Yuvina. Uh... A manor? Around to buy flowers? Oh, it's over there. It's, it's on the map. Pure and Juvena have done well for themselves. Well, it's in this direction anyway. I thought I'd have to completely find it for myself. But apparently not. Alright, here we go. The house is surrounded by flowers. I need your eyes. That looks like flowers to me. Is that guy wearing shorts? It's freezing here. Are you insane? Here, yeah, this is their home. Counselor's house. Oh, nice. Place has been ransacked, and this body. It's not your Olufna. Scattered scrolls. The thief was looking for something. Oh no! Why is there just tragedy everywhere I go? Well, I was just gonna get a nice welcome, like, hey, how's it going? But no. We have to. There has to be pain and Let's suffering over. Here. Looks like it continued outside. Blood, but nobody. Which way did they go? I think they definitely went this way. Is this one of the thieves? The trail continues. Closer. Now! It's... it's me, Juvena. It's Eivor. Eivor? What? Who sent you? Are you with them? Breathe, Juvena. You're rattled. You know me. I'm a friend. Are you? You show up here like this. These people tried to kill me. I heard there was trouble in Jorvik. I have only come to help. On my honor. I am sorry, Eivor. I did not mean to doubt you. It has been a tense few weeks. Who were they? Why were they after you? They were after this. I do not know what it is, but these men were ready to kill me for it. A poor fellow soldier of Christ. Oh, we heard that you before. You know him? I've seen a letter like this before, in London. This city is in great danger. Where is your? At the Royal Hall, 
I will take you there. He was the one who Before killed that guy in London. Be safe just yet. This way better be hooded. Yeah, he was the one who organized it in London, I believe. If I'm remembering correctly. They are still looking for me. Hide low. We can slip past them. All right. Why can't I? Is that so? Holy heck, that's annoying. She can't have gotten far. Look around. He's literally walking right past you. Let's go. She's walking with them. That's pretty funny. Come on, game. Oh my goodness, I gotta get past this guy. Hold a moment. Have you seen a Bajarmian woman? Answer well if you know what's good for you. I, I haven't seen her, I swear. Hey. Oh, are you serious? Alrighty, guys. I think we can try this again. She has gone around the corner, so we should be fine to do so now. Keep an eye out. Please don't look at me. Let's go. Waiting for us up there. Okay, I died the first time, by the way, guys. Those guys wrecked me. Really do not want to get caught. But heck, she just walks straight past them. I can't do that. Hey, I want to talk to you. Talk you. All right, we'll just have to go down this way. Run away from him. Well, I think it is safe now. Gods, Eivor. Your arrival could not be better timed. Call it fate. I had hoped our paths would cross again. Though I imagined a calmer reunion. We fled one problem only to find ourselves embroiled in another. While King Richier is preoccupied with the money shortage, a group called the Red Hand has been imposing their will. The ones who attacked you? Yes and no. They are bandits, but someone is controlling them. Look no further than the names in that letter. Killing them is the reason I'm here. But they are coated. They could belong to anyone. The slush in the streets often drips from the goddess of the halls. When in doubt, look to those in power. You mean the council? Hjord is on the council. That works in our favor. Someone we can trust to find the answers we seek. Yes, we are nearly there. Nice. That's a, that's a pretty cool longhouse. I like it. Come on, friend, let's go. Royal Hall. Yes, and they, they haven't you're. fixed the cloak on the stairs. The Look at it. Come. come on, Ubisoft. Come on. Pleases me to see you, old friend. All are welcome here in Jorvik. It is good to find you well, Jor. Both of you. What are you doing here? You have not come all this way for the Yuletide. I've come to warn you, old warrior, about a rut in your city. Three figures, corrupt and dangerous. We should work together to bring them into the light and kill them before they come to power. However I may help, I am ready. Slow yourselves. Eivor. We cannot just go running around the city, poking and prodding and killing at will. They nearly did me, Jor. What? 
These people send the Red Hand after her, ready to shed blood in your streets to keep themselves a secret. But they failed. Uh, this is the letter that was sent to our home. The Needle, the Firebrand, the Vault. They belong to a group called the Order of Ancients. These are their assumed names, our leads. Listen to her, Jor. She has dealt with their kind before. Corruption has seeped its way into Jorvik. But King Rishia's hands are full, which means my hands are full. Counsel on this matter will fall on deaf ears. I do not want his counsel. All I have told you stays between the three of us. But you should introduce me to the king. I'll need to align with him if we are to go about this freely. are winning this war. We should be scraping together every ounce of silver to procure food for our men. Understood, dear Farafin. But we also have a responsibility to our townspeople. The Yuletide must go on. Enough. The more you argue, the more my head hurts. Cure. I was not aware we had company. The likes of which I did not approve. King Rissie. I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. Well, Eivor of the Raven Clan, as you can see, I'm in the middle of something. Hyor, perhaps for lack of better judgment, deems it necessary that you interrupt. Why? You have a problem in Jorvik. Yes, I'm looking at it. A problem that nearly got my friend killed. Juvena was attacked by the Red Hand. They raided her home, destroyed her property, and chased her through the streets. Those bloody scoundrels again. She survived, but the Red Hand has been a growing problem here of late. And what is your stake in this? You some sort of wandering mercenary? Not no. this time. This is Sigurd Jarl's Drenger. Took our old camp by the river Nene, as I hear it. I am Farawid, war chief to Haftan Ragnarsson, and this well fed Westral is Audun, High Reef of Jorvik. I have seen rebel groups like this before. They sit and wait, and the moment you lower your guard, they spring up like weeds. Left alone, they will take Jorvik out from under you. Not what you want, not what Hafton wants. Oh dear. What do you want? Tell me what you know about the Red Hand, and I'll rid your city of them. You can go about your affairs. They've been sticking their hands in coffers around the city, targeting nobles, merchants, and anyone else they can throttle. And they are growing, as you said. I would rather not be worrying about them come Yuletide. This is not something we can afford to ignore. If we do not have the means to deal with the Red Hand, we should let Eivor... Do what you can, but do it quietly. I do not want the public alarmed. Cure. Send funds to procure food and ale for Faravid's men. And make sure there's enough left over for the feast. But it's as I said. We don't have... Find it. I have spoken. <laughs> what are you, the guy from the Mandalorian? Tells me to find more silver. Where? In a dragon's hoard? Come, I will take you back to Lufina. She will know where to begin. I'm sure I can give him some silver, I right? I cannot tell if that went the way you had hoped. It went well enough. Rishie will stay out of my way. No one can argue the red hand must be dealt with. Speak a word of this to no one. A circle of trust must stay between the three of us. There's someone's uh, thing. Oh, pretty cool. Hello. You will forgive me for stepping away. I grow weary of those pissing contests. Uh, my love, I am sorry for what happened. I should have been there. Nonsense. You have your duties to fulfill. Besides, a few bandits is hardly something to worry over. I am only glad you were not harmed. Eivor, I will be around if you need me. Once you catch the tail, you do not let go. Old habits die with the struggle. Jor has changed, softened. Politics. It takes the Norse out of a Norse. I'm happy for him. You've made something of yourselves here. Perhaps. What do you have there? Christian texts, the Gospels, Ecclesiastes, the Revelation of John. The Red Hand steals all they can find. 
We may run the city now, but the Christians must still be allowed to worship as they see fit. Seems the Red Hand disagrees. What's more, Althon is worried they will come for the Archives next. Between this and all the uproar at the harbor, I would say we have some leads. What does the Red Hand want with Christian texts? That is the question. Whatever it is, there is no length they will not go to to retrieve them. They have even burned people alive who refuse to hand over what they demand. Where is the largest collection of texts in the city? The Archives. But they haven't been so bold as to attack it yet. Alzon keeps a close eye on the place. I'll try my luck there. I went by the harbor when I first arrived. The Dogmaster looked wary when I asked about you. That does not surprise me. He's been using Jorvik's money shortage to increase taxes. As if he's been ordered to by the Council. Jor would never wrong the people like that, even if Rishie demanded it. The Dark Master is a thief and a liar. A man in need of a throttling. I'll have another look around the harbor. Try the trade depot. It's where he's holding the merchant's wares. I'll get started at once. No, I need you here. Listen to the voices in this hall. Look for any signs, changes in behavior, anything. I would swallow a horse heart to join you, Eivor. I know, old friend. Your loyalty is why I need you here. I'll return when I find something. Alrighty. So we have a few things to go off there, guys, but uh, that's where I'm going to end this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please hit the like button, subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys in the very next episode.